I'm Eric Kane from Hosemaster. There are a handful of basic attributes that apply to all hoses, regardless of their type or their application. What materials they're made from, their pressure handling capabilities, and perhaps most importantly, how flexible they are. We use hoses in so many different applications because they can flex. They do the work that most rigid components can't do. And when it comes to understanding flexibility, the main performance attribute that we use is what's called minimum bend radius. The minimum bend radius is the point to which the hose can be bent without risking damage to either the material itself or to by kinking the hose. There are a few specific things to remember when measuring the bend requirements of an application. The minimum bend can be expressed as either a radius from the center or a diameter. Keep this in mind when looking at a manufacturer's specs. In both cases, we start the measurement from the center line of the hose, as opposed to the side. This distance may not seem like much, but it can make a huge difference as the hose gets larger in size or as the bend requirements become tighter. Finally, metal hoses have two measurements instead of just one for non-metal hoses, static and dynamic. Dynamic is the tightest the hose can be bent to and cycled to meaning that it can be bent that tightly, relaxed, and then bent to that point again over and over without any additional damage. The static measurement is much tighter and therefore a smaller bend, but it assumes that the hose will not be cycling in service. So the hose can be bent a little bit farther without affecting its life. If you want more information on hose performance or industry terms, make sure to check out our website or give us a call and we'd be happy to help you.